Our product Vital Life is actually a pre-probiotic preparation. This type of preparation is actually to enhance the microorganisms that are found in our intestines, especially our large intestine. The function of these uh, microorganisms or the natural microflora inside our colon or large intestine is to digest foods that have never been digested during our eating process. It is very important that these microorganisms must be present in order to aid our system, our digestive system, in controlling the uh, absorption or in enhancing absorption of nutrients as well as maintenance of pH balance, the boosting of the immune system in the human body. So, what is the relationship of this vital life towards our uh, supplementation? It is very important because according to medical studies, it was found out that our health is closely related or linked to the state of our intestines. As a matter of fact, according to the Royal Society of Medicine of London, England, that 90% of the modern chronic diseases are due to the poor functions of the intestinal tract because of the destructions of these microorganisms. Most often, if one is overfed, if you have eaten lots of food, these microorganisms easily die. So what do you do? You have to strengthen these microorganisms in order to maintain balance as well as aid digestion of food in the gastrointestinal tract. But how do you obtain this pre-probiotic system? It's just so simple. As we grow, the children grow, we obtain it from the natural environment. But these are very fragile and difficult to isolate in the laboratory conditions. The history of probiotics started with the work of Dr. Minoru Shirota, who has discovered the Lactobacilli Case Sirota strain. Actually, what he did was to isolate the natural microorganism Lactobacilli from the intestines and culture them in laboratory in order to uh, multiply the number of microorganisms. Why is this so? This is so because in nature, it is very difficult to multiply these microorganisms uh, in uh, laboratory conditions. Much more, if these microorganisms are left alone, they easily die when the food are so plenteous or meaning you have plenty of food inside your intestines. So what Minoru Shirota did was to isolate it and culture them in laboratory and then it reintroduced it as live organisms. That is why we call it probiotics. So what is really the role of probiotics? The role of probiotics is to inhibit the growth of bad bacteria by virtue of what you call competitive inhibition. So if you have your natural flora inside your intestines, there is no room for the bad bacteria. So how do we go through about it? Our vital life has actually a strain of microorganisms. We call it EC12, which is an award-winning microorganism in Japan, which is actually Enterococcus fecalis another strain of microorganism that normally lives in our intestines. So what, what these scientists did was to culture them and uh, culture them in mass uh, or large amount and reintroduce this into the uh, human intestine. In this preparation, it is actually dried cells of this uh, EC12, which contributes an oligosaccharide or a substance that when taken, it will improve the microorganisms inside you in order to increase the number of microflora in our own body. So in other words, this vital life will just be a, a stimulus in order to maintain your own microflora despite the fact that you have been eating so much. So it's a, it's a kind of protective mechanism in order to maintain this microflora and so that they will not die easily. So this is the mechanism of our vital life. And the most uh, important thing that is done by this microorganism is because they thrive in our system and they are good, they produce a natural antibiotic. We call it bacteriocins. 
These bactericins are proteins that kills other microorganisms which may invade in our own system. So then, if you take this vital life, you are provided by a natural antibiotic produced by these microorganisms. So that is precisely how this makes it uh, very natural because it comes from these microorganisms that helps us protect from the invasion of the other harmful microorganisms. Now what is the importance of really increasing the microorganisms in our intestines? One is that uh, it will prevent the occurrence of what you call coprostasis or the accumulation of fecal materials in view of the lack of uh, bowel movement. Normally this happens when a person is so under stress or the person has eaten a lot. Now with this uh, microflora or what you call the probiotics that is introduced, coprostasis is prevented. Now, fecal matters that are not removed from the body within the period of 18 to 24 hours becomes toxic because uh, these microorganisms that are present there also degrades uh, food materials in the process called putrefaction. So putrefaction is a process inside our colon and normally uh, what are recovered there are minerals and water and as a matter of fact some vitamin B are produced in this colon. However, if those waste materials are not removed, then this will create what you call toxicity. Lots of disorders, even heart diseases, could be derived from these coprostatic um, materials uh, due to loss, uh, so less bowel movement. So it is very important then for that we have to increase the level or to enliven or to invigorate the microorganisms through our vital life. And one tablet of this Vitalife is equivalent to about 25 bottles of any ordinary uh, probiotic system. So it's very efficient, convenient. Wherever you go, you can just bring it with you in your pocket and it will protect you from possible traveler's diarrheal disease. Another importance of probiotics is that uh, most of us are consuming lots of uh, coffee or alcohol or junk foods or worse is you'll be taking so much drugs. Drugs can destroy the microflora. So definitely you will be affected because without this microflora there will be imbalances inside our gastrointestinal tract. So in order to strengthen them it is very important that we should take this very potent stimulator of microflora. We call it Vitalife. It's actually an uh, oligosaccharide that is taken from the cells of these microorganisms which stimulates the growth of microflora inside our human body.